Well, a very, very warm welcome to you on what is, of course, a truly special day in this part of the world. It is Derby Day, a rivalry so deeply entrenched into the history of sport in this land. It divides opinions, it divides families, it divides just about anything that can be divided. The game itself lasts just 90 minutes, but its repercussions can be felt for months and years ahead. So red and white, of course, the preeminent colours at Old Trafford, which is now officially the largest club football ground in England. Its capacity, 75,000 and growing. Well, it's a friendly in theory, but we are expecting this to be fiercely contested. Well, in games of this nature, as a player, Peter, you only want to work as hard as demanded. You don't want to have to go at it full pelt. But when the opposition is what it is, all of that kind of goes out the window. The challenge here will ask more of you, and so both teams will, will wish to, to give more than they take. It's one of those games, Peter, where if the opposition increase their effort, you have to follow it. There's the whistle. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Yeah, Ederson. He's got great technique, Peter, and for a goalkeeper, he's got the passing range of a top-class midfielder. I think his, his team will be looking to use him as a, a foundation from which to build both sustained spells of possession as well as quick counter-attacks. He's got a phenomenal left foot. Yeah, I'd have picked him too. No doubt the fans feel much the same way. McTominay, Wan-Bissaka tries to get it forward quickly. Greenish tried to play it through. Yeah, the idea was right. The delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. And here's Rashford. Shaw drilled in low. He's had a shot. McTominay has got himself a free kick. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score, and obviously he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? And we have the first dead ball situation of the game, promising one. Manchester United with a free kick. Cristiano Ronaldo! And it's Shaw. Shaw just shapes the shoot! Great effort, beautifully taken. Yeah, the shot was enabled, Peter, due to such smart control and technique. Cristiano Ronaldo. Rashford. Ruben Diaz did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. Foden goes looking. De Bruyne. Shaw with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. finish of the highest order there is the breakthrough oh that is a bit special
Manchester City themselves into the lead. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Now it's Sterling. Sterling tries making a foray down the right. Varane can get it clear. Well, it seems as if he's just had a momentary lapse and, and slipped into tunnel vision because he had good options around him and he failed to get his head up. Bruno Fernandes gets it back. McTominay. Forward it goes. And it's Rashford. Not much subtlety, he's launched himself there. Bruno Fernandes. And it's Sancho. Cristiano Ronaldo. Rashford plays it forward. That's not going to go down too well with his teammates. Gabriel Jesus drives it forward. Maguire does well to read it and intercepts. Foden. Fernandinho. Now it's De Bruyne. Gabriel. Big chance! Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Real chance to break. Sancho tries a pass forward. That's ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. And the half-time whistle goes. So there you have it, a close fought half of football, but one that still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. Not the most convincing of displays, they could certainly do much better than this. They'll want to keep things simple, build up their confidence and not rush into mistakes. And we are already promptly back on the way. Manchester United need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by just the right amount of caution and I think the more experienced players can oversee that. And it's Sancho. Kyle Walker, Fernandinho, hoists it forward, Gabriel Jesus! Rafael Varane, Bruno Fernandes, and it's Sancho, Rafael Varane, and it's played forward, Sancho, oh, shooting chance! It's in! Manchester United are back on level terms. Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Yeah, it's a very good contest with two very good sides and with such great individual talent on show, it could go either way. Ronaldo drives it forward. Rashford. Could be a chance here. And they've been... And the shot! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. Great leap! 
decent attempt, but not quite good enough. Ronaldo is now the subject of some adhesive marking. Yeah, and they finally reacted, but they could have been more switched on before he, he scored. He's gone for it! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Well, I think the opposition was pretty sloppy in creating a problem for themselves then, but he was onto it so quickly and very nearly made them pay. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Foden. Stones. Fernandinho. It's a good foot in there. Rashford. Ra hits one! He's got away with one there. Changes then in quick succession. Kyle Walker. Stones. And it's Sancho. Rashford. And the shot! Same again, same outcome. Manchester United really are in the ascendancy here and they know they have to register while that's the case. Ruben Diaz. 25 minutes played. Oh, real danger here! Ederson deals with it effortlessly. He's made sure that that won't get through. But Tomine. One Bissaka. One Bissaka huddling down that right flank. Tomine. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. And it's Sancho. Manchester United showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. It's Fernandez! Oh, that was no routine save. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. For a change in personnel well he's worked so hard for his side uh, as you would expect but he couldn't help notice that he was starting to to labor a bit so it's no surprise and it's Sancho well both sides might have to settle for a draw here although there's still a chance for one last fling Aran gets into the right position to intercept Official showing that there will be three minutes of added time. And he spotted the run and played him through. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. So nothing between them after all of that, and you can't really argue with the result. Neither manager too unhappy with the outcome, and the fans really.